Hey guys, how's it going? Isabella from Aquazona Cream Services here. And at last, after 48 hours of a crazy transfer between my 65 and this new aquarium, which is a 90 or maybe even a 100, I'm not sure. Uh, the fish are all in. They're all doing really well. They're happy. No one died. No casualties. Um, the corals are starting to pop out a little bit, so I'm going to come closer and show you. Um, just since this morning, honestly, the corals started opening it up. Uh, the fish are all in there. I still have my little geriatric uh, uh, yellow tang that's still bouncing around. The other, uh, the fox face is underneath because this guy right here is intimidating him. But overall, they're all alive and doing well. The anemone is still here. So yeah, and I changed also the pump for a more performant one, but which is super, super strong. So I only have it at 30%. And I still got my Kessel AP700 on this, my little refugium. And if you look up here, uh, you're probably gonna notice that the refugium is fed by my canister filter. So just a little trickle here. I got my skimmer here and yeah. Fish are all doing so good. They're cute. And actually on the bottom, I managed to fit a 70 gallon, which will be probably for breeding discus and other things. Um, we'll see, we'll see. The discus are back in their tank while this one is cycling. But all in all, this is what's up. And uh, I also changed the side. It used to be on this side, now it's on that side. So it can be lined up with my other rack, of other fish. My pride and joy here below so they'll all be able to look at each other and yeah it was well worth the effort honestly um, I work hard but the fish are safe they have lots more space uh, they're swimming well so you know sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do to save the fish so if you like this video please subscribe like the video and leave me a comment if you have anything to say okay see you next time bye bye